Hello, hello. Completely unexpected um, live video from me. But I want to come on here because I've been doing a lot of calls. And I'm noticing like a recurring theme for new entrepreneurs. And even like some of us OGs or like veterans of being in business, we can sometimes get caught in these like paralysis traps. So I want to touch on that for a hot second tonight and see if this resonates with any of you guys. So if you are brand new, we have so many brand new people in here, which like thrills me to my core. I want to welcome you. I want to introduce myself. My name is Brittany Budd and I am the creator and facilitator of this amazing group. And I am so excited that you are here. I am a mindset and business coach. And what I do is I equip entrepreneurs just like you with the strategies, tools, and resources that you need to start stepping up in your business, start taking bold action and start getting real results. And that usually equals money, doesn't it? <laughs> so welcome, welcome, welcome. Tonight I'm talking about being stuck, being in paralysis, being totally engulfed in fear. And like I say, sometimes this, I mean, always this happens with brand new entrepreneurs. You know, you're just, you're just thinking about dipping your toe in the pot, pond of entrepreneurship. But even some of us veterans can get stuck in this fear cocoon where we don't really want to do anything. And so I want to pose this to you guys tonight. How many of you are stuck in this fear paralysis zone right now. Um, maybe it's been a few days. Maybe it's been a few months. Maybe it's been years for some of you that are just like wanting all of your ducks in a row. You want to know exactly like who your ideal client is, what your messaging needs to be. You, you have all of these things that you have placed in your mind that need to be on point and ready to roll before you even say a word about your business. And I want to tell you guys, if that's you and you're really afraid of doing the wrong action, my friends, there is no such thing as the wrong action. The only wrong thing you're doing is no action at all. Letting those fears completely engulf your entire life, your whole business, doing nothing is the worst thing you can do. Do something. There is no wrong action. There's action and there's no action. Please pick action. Even if you do decide to act, and maybe it's not the greatest action, we have all been there, but now you've learned something. We're always failing forward. You've learned something. Okay. Uh, let me, let me give you some examples here. Um, I'm getting a lot of people that want to blog <laughs> and they want to make money blogging and they don't know where to start. And they're just kind of like in this spiral of, what do I talk about? Do I talk about my business? Do I talk about my life? Do I buy a domain? What domain do I, like, platform do I use? What do I use as my domain name? What do I start doing? What the, the, and they start asking all of these crazy questions that don't even matter right now. Right now, let's just start acting. Like, pick, pick something. Okay, buy a domain or start blogging in your personal Facebook page where it's free. Just start writing and see what happens. Um, I had a call with one of my clients the other day and she's trying to figure out her purpose. And I said, girlfriend, you want a coach. You don't know what type of coach you want to be. There's not going to be this like magic lightning bolt that's just going to like come flying down to this from the sky that tells you what kind of coach you want to be. You need to just start coaching and then figure out what kind of coach you want to be. There's no wrong actions. There's just action or no action. You'll never find out what you want to be doing in life if you're not trying on the hats. 
you're not doing the things you're not putting yourself out there you're not testing the waters to see what you like I mean it's like if you wanted to like play an instrument and you were like I just like music but I don't know what instrument I like try a couple you're allowed to try on a couple so different than buying an outfit you know try a couple outfits on you don't have to just buy the first one you see try a couple on and see how they fit no action is a million times worse than making an action even if it's not the best choice you know even if it doesn't work out for you just start moving your body my friends so <clears throat> i just felt like with my clients anyway this has been like a recurring theme of I don't want to move because I don't know where I'm moving to. So I'm just going to stay here until it is revealed to me. And it's not going to be revealed to you sitting still. You need to start moving forward and just going down the paths you enjoy. How did I become a life and business coach or a mindset and business coach? You know, you know life's included in that because I just started coaching on anything. Like way back in the day when I started coaching, guys, I was doing like couples coaching, like talking about people's marriages. I was doing all kinds of coaching. And guess what? I don't like talking about people's marriages. Although that does go um, a lot of times in business where people are like, my husband doesn't support me. What do I do? This was not that. And I learned real quick. I don't want to talk to people about their marriages. This kind of stinks. I want to talk about other things. So just start moving your bodies, you guys. Put it out there. I'm going to blog. I'm going to coach. I'm looking for clients. I want to do this. I'm doing that. Fail forward. You have to learn. It's like a kid learning how to walk, you know? They get up, they pull themselves up, and they start going. And it takes a couple of tries, and it takes some trial and error, and it takes some bumps and bruises and falls and tears. But they're moving. Okay, so if you're feeling like you've had this calling on your heart lately, and you're a little bit confused on what you're supposed to be doing. And I just want to like tell you guys, nothing has to be perfect. You just have to start moving. Okay. Um, so with that being said, for those of you that are in this space of feeling stuck, feeling paralyzed, you know, it's a lot of mindset blocks, and confidence and lack of clarity on what it is that you're trying to accomplish because this is my zone of genius you may hear me talking about zone of genius a lot i really like the term it, this is my zone of genius i am happy to pull this stuff out of you so that you can live in your zone of genius and make money doing it because that's what we all want we're all here to make some money we're all here to reach our goals, quit our day jobs, be home more, travel, do whatever we want, aren't we? So if you are one of those people and you're feeling like, I'm stuck, I'm paralyzed, I have all these thoughts that are going through my mind, I have all these things that I need to get totally perfectly lined up before I can do anything, false, let's talk, okay? <laughs> I am going to get you on a clear road, a clear pathway to what it is you're trying to accomplish. I'm going to let you know the things that you need to be doing right now, the things that can wait, the things that you haven't even thought of that need to be done and help you start making those dreams happen. Help you start getting those clients, help you start making that money on that blog. That is what I do. And so I give free 45 minute strategy sessions. And here's like, here's how it goes. You guys, you book a session with me. We get on the phone, we get on zoom. I love Zoom. You're going to tell me about your business. You're going to tell me about your struggles. You're going to tell me about your goals. I am then going to assess all of that because that is what I do. I'm going to tell you what I see as a plan of what needs to be happening in your business. And then we talk about how we can work together a little bit more so I can make sure that you get that shit done. Okay? So... <clears throat> I still have one spot left for March, but I have a lot of calls coming up and I have um, a wait list starting. So message me here. How about I oh, have to do it after I'll put the link for you to just schedule a call. You don't even have to message me. Just schedule a call. 
and we will get on the phone together and work this stuff out because you guys, I have seen women stuck in this paralysis for like over a year, some of these girls. I can't. There's no need. Let's move forward. Let's make money. Let's make dreams happen. This is what I do. So I'll put my link in the comments, you guys. If you enjoyed this, give me a big thumbs up. Make sure to tag your friends. Oh, and one last thing before I hop off real quick. Um, I'm about to go into a coaching session, actually. Invite your friends. <laughs> If you love this group as much as I do, which I totally love this group, the deadline is in like three days for um, the big giveaway, Karen Dedrick. You know, she approached me. She's like, I love this group. I want to help you grow it. Let me do a travel giveaway. And I was like, can I win? <laughs> which no, I cannot win. That's not fair. But all you have to do is invite five friends, five Five invitations equal one ballot. The people do not have to accept, although it is amazing when they do accept, but you just have to invite them. Five invites equals one ballot and it's a draw. So you only need one ballot to win. So go ahead, invite some people that you think would benefit from being in here with us. Do everyone a favor and make sure that they are a leader, a coach, or an entrepreneur because if it's just your next door neighbor and you just want to get a ballot, they're probably not going to join. And if they do join, they're probably not going to enjoy it. Um, so invite those high vibe, entrepreneurial, like-minded people into this amazing community. And I'll see you guys later. Mwah.